shop this was 20 euros which is quite expensive I'm just gonna have this as a souvenir and wear it all day I don't know what this is so there I am got the ears on just did my hair I'm in Main Street USA I went to Disneyland was when I was with my family over 10 years later I'm here. It's currently 10 a.m. Hey guys, so I just got my photos taken. It was actually easier than I thought. to take photos. I went on the left side of the castle so there were less people there. I will update you guys. I remember going in this restaurant last time with my family. Pirates of Caribbean ride is closed. This is so nice. Jones and it was good but a bit scary I went upside down but it was good that was my first proper ride the good thing is that I got to skip the queue because of the single rider queue which was amazing that was Indiana Jones oh my god would recommend if you're into rides I was a bit nervous when I went on there I'm gonna see if I can go on Big Thunder Mountain I also want to go and see It's a Small World I'm gonna put my Mickey Mouse ears back on the weather is lovely Okay. 
I just went on Peter Pan's flight. The wait was so long, but now I'm about to have some food. I can see the pink castle from here. It's lovely. I'm currently in Fantasyland. My favorite land in Disneyland so far would be Adventureland. So I just got fish and chips and a cup of coke. I know this isn't the most healthy. I'm definitely going to eat something in Disneyland. This altogether costed 16 euros, which I know isn't cheap, especially since this is in Disneyland. I will eat this. I'll probably go on more rides after this. I definitely want to go back on Indiana Jones. <laughs> Land. I'm going on some more rides definitely. The weather is hot. Ever since I think I was 16 years old I've always wanted to go to Disneyland and now finally today is the day. If you've got a dream destination, dream place, if you dream of traveling it can be made into a reality. I've been wanting to go to Disneyland for so long and now here I am. Finally I've got the courage to go. I'm going to walk around, relax, go on some more rides. So, yeah. I also got a lot more photos taken. I just went on Indiana Jones. It was kind of scary. Now I'm heading to Big Thunder Mountain. I don't think I'm going to get a fast pass. It's currently around 5 p.m. I'm just going with the flow, taking my time. Indiana Jones was probably the most scary ride. I was just exploring Disneyland. Now I'm gonna go into Discoveryland. I also want to keep exploring Disneyland. I'm going to explore more and show you guys. Blueberry ice cream, this was five euros. So now I am heading to Discovery Land. I'd like to go on Space Mountain. I kind of wanted to meet Mickey Mouse and take a photo with him. That would be so cute. I realized it closed at 7 p.m. and the wait time was two hours. But next time I go to Disneyland, I would like to meet him. I would meet him. I can't do everything all the time. Ah, I'm planning to stay here a bit longer. Ah, I see the Orbitron. I actually didn't go on Space Mountain because I felt like my back had some pain. I just didn't feel safe. Aww. Even though I queued for that long, I just had this gut feeling to not. It was just too claustrophobic for me. Maybe in the future I'll try it out, but there it is. So I'm planning to go on a better ride for me, preferably outside. I feel my back. Hey guys, so it's currently quarter to 10 and I'm about to leave Disneyland. I've been here for just over 12 hours, which is good. I am missing the Paralusion, the fireworks thing, because I'm traveling back by myself. I'm planning to get back not too late. We'll be visiting Disneyland again for sure. My back, my legs hurt, especially from all that queuing. I understand why the fast pass, the premier access is good. I've done enough now. I'm just walking around, staying here for a little bit more, and then I'm going to make my way back 
the next day so I just had breakfast got ready I'm going out today so yeah that was my Paris Disneyland vlog I'm going to Montmartre Sacre Coeur and possibly on a bus tour and then go with the flow the next two to three days I'm just taking it easy I'm just going to chill go at my own pace I'll probably take a couple of videos on my phone and put it in the first Paris vlog. I'm more settled in Paris. The first day just felt really weird and I felt kind of homesick, but it's getting better. I had breakfast in the B&B &B downstairs. Honestly, I prefer Joe and Joe in Jontilly. I recommend that more than this. Breakfast, the options are more limited. I just prefer Joe and Joe personally. I'm just going to go out, have fun. I'll definitely go back there again. It's an amazing experience. I highly recommend getting the fast pass if you're going there for just one day because the queues can be long i went on tuesday which is during the week but it was still busy going there by yourself is a great experience i would also go there with a friend or with family next time because i also want to share the experience with someone else you know it has been my dream destination for years i had it on my travel list and now finally i got it done i visited it the last time i visited disneyland was literally 11 years ago with my family and i actually remember it it was a lovely magical experience and my favorite ride was the big thunder mountain that was so i really liked it indiana jones was kind of scary i really liked adventureland as well as fantasyland i had a shower last night thank you so much for watching this disneyland vlog and i'll see you guys very very soon thank you so much for subscribing definitely hit the subscribe button i'll see you guys very very soon bye